amazing I'm telling you this is art in its finest can you believe that um, this sculpture is made of equal metal of which many of us would have easily disposed of as rubbish but these students pick this thing up and they are able to craft something as beautiful and majestic as this this is a lion made of scraps metals for that matter the artwork is so 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 crafty isn't this very amazing i mean make something out of nothing that's what we call this Like I said earlier, use uh, scraps from metal to make something as majestic. I think it's made of uh, craft from metals and uh, and uh, art with sand and cement or something. It's very, 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 very fun. Looking at this, I think this is a kangaroo. Hey, you can see a kangaroo carrying the baby kangaroo awards on it too. Wow. For those of us that you know throws away all our metal, we can pick something out of this, like right? nothing is actually a waste. Not too big. This is fine. And this this looks like a dinosaur. We said the home. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what we are talking about when we talk about African heritage, our art, our sculpture. It appreciates and uh, keeps us different from what the rest of the world does with their own artwork. You can see that looks like a chimpanzee, but I think it's the uh, young ones. 
And this all can only be given to you on our own channel. So don't go nowhere. We have a whole lot of things to cover here. And I'm enjoying myself already. And I hope the viewers too are enjoying it. So let me stay here and talk. Let me. Mm. Oh, yeah, action. Wow. This is a giant crop indeed. You can see, um, I think it's made of a chain. Chain. A motorcycle chain. And the finishing is what that beats my imagination. something out of craft metal. How creative can we be? This is a generator, a generator, generator component, bike component, even plates, local plates, uh, plates that we use in it. This is something I call a dragonfly. I might be wrong, or I might be right. But I, I think whoever that designed this thing did a marvelous job. Don't forget, these are students. These are students, not professional sculptors. These are students that did this work that I, we are bringing to you on this channel. Imagine what they would do in parallel battle.
guys we are in another segment and you can see what I'm looking at at this very particular section and I'm blown away already. These are pictures of uh, very very important people in Nigeria and the students put these pictures together to give us a cool um, artwork that should be in Ujuku. And you can see in between those uh, galleries of pictures, you can see a border pieces embedded on it. And these border pictures are not just common pictures, they are important, uh, important pictures of people that we consider heroes of Nigeria. Faces of those that did something to gain us independence. So I read the camera to. Said earlier, we are here in Yaba Art Museum and that disabled intelligent fellow there. Please, what is your name? Uh, my name is Benjamin Uwala. Okay, uh, what faculty are you from? I'm actually from Environmental Studies. Environmental Studies. And the Department of Surveying and Diplomatic Studies. Okay, that should be a very, very interesting department. Uh, we are taking coverage of what we saw here and we saw you like you like art too. Um I'm by nature by God's grace I am an art person. Alright. Sometimes I get to regret why I don't really like to study the arts. I I got a slot for another thing so I had to go for it. When I see arts I can interpret what that art is and when I see art I see life. Okay. I see not just art, I see I see life that has been from that art. When you see art, art depicts several things. In fact, even nature is art itself. When God created everything, it's not about art. How you view them. So art is like life. So when I see art, it's only and when, when I see quality in art, it actually gets me to sit down to stay. That was when I was passing by. I also this to my You couldn't just wait. I just saw like I saw something up. unique. Ah. I read this about pictures of it kind of like mosaic and when I saw this pictures collated to form beautiful softens mm -hmm. I was like in gross I had to check this stuff before you guys came along I still gonna go check this I don't know after you guys go <laughs> <laughs> and I can't blame you I can't blame you because when we walked in here we, we are amazed at like sure. how these students were able to make good stuff out of scrap metal this is something we give out give out you know throw away you know one thing about art is Nigerians really different I believe that art, uh, which a person applies for about 20,000 uh, in Nigeria, when they go to abroad, they will actually take it as a fortune. Okay. They actually take it as, the uh, Nigeria will just take it around and look at them and just number of things. They can actually put it out, kind of like in a museum, if possible, selling for millions of dollars. Of course, of course. I mean, I see art even along the street, along the road. I, I get myself so fantasized about all this art, but people just see the stuff like, it's a number of things. They all build yeah. up cement and build this stuff above men, please. That thing illustrates a lot of things. It could actually reflect our culture. 
Culture is a very rich nature. Culture talks about several things. It's a ritual which has been happening for a long time. Christianity is also kind of like the train the way it's happening. So seeing art, it has a lot of story embedded in it. A lot of story. But it's not about you just seeing. It's you seeing and looking deep and relating with the sense of that art, with the nature and how it came out. That is the only just seeing. Guys, you have said it all. I don't think that's I have anything to say. That's a little too. So I'm we are encouraging everybody to go out there and enjoy art. We love it. Buy it. And it's even good to keep around that house. Pardon me, you can come to your back you see art. For you. Yeah, thank you for your time. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Sitting here, I got time. It's clear to see from up here. The world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful. So what are you trying to make here? A half face. Okay, is there a picture or something? Okay, so this is it. Oh wow. Continue, continue.
guys were done from the Yaba Tech Museum. It's, it's mind blowing, man. The things that we saw, the things I saw, they were so nice. I'm telling you. They were so chill. Like, you see them in the video that we made for you. It's so interesting. Everything is okay. Like, I think it's way, way better than what we've done over time. You understand? So, make sure you enjoy them with my partner here, Leno. And then we're saying, we're saying, we're saying goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye from, from us. From us. <laughs> <laughs> from everything from lifetime tv channel lifetime tv channel tv show That's don't where... forget to subscribe like, and oh. watch like comment this is very 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 oh, the, very very important hello <laughs> <laughs> happy viewing guys